This is specifically for YouTubers and content creators. You do not have to pay for expensive AI tools for you to get consistent images for your YouTube videos, especially if you're a YouTube faceless content creator. Also, if you're showing your face like me, you don't have to go to the studio, wear makeup and do your hair, wear fine clothes just because you want to take pictures for your YouTube thumbnails. I made this mistake earlier last year during my birthday period. I had to take pictures with branded t-shirts so that I could do pictures for my thumbnails. I spent money on my hair, on makeup, on I paid a lot for the photography and all of that. All of this could have been saved. I could have saved that money. I used to probably eat chicken and turkey and I would have just used AI to do this, but I did not know that I could use AI. That is why I'm creating this video. So you don't waste money like I did, right? You can use AI to generate consistent image characters showing a shocked face, excited face, anything. Even after I did that, my photo shoot, guess what? I still needed more because I did not do an image of me holding money. I didn't do an image of me jumping in excitement. And I needed those things for some of my videos that I eventually did. I didn't think about it then, but I later needed it. So if you're like me and you don't photo shoot and you only did like three faces because you're trying to save money and now you need other faces and you're thinking of going back to the studio, about mission cancel your plans and use ai to get this done see what i was able to do with ai i got different faces different reactions even holding money different things so if your channel is about finance you can get a character holding money jumping or pressing a laptop whatever it is you want to achieve with ai oh yeah let's get straight into the tutorial but before we get there have you shared this video have you shared this video click on the share button right now it's free this tutorial is free the only payment or the only thing i require from you is just share it please post on your whatsapp status post on your instagram story even share it on this youtube here in case you have a channel too just click on the share button and share it on youtube all right let's get straight into it okay so what you have to do is to go to this website called gemini g-e-m-i-n-i -I. just go to gemini.google.com i also put the link in the description now take a selfie of yours Upload it to Gemini, right? Pick a selfie of yours, any selfie of yours that is showing your face very well, and then upload it to Gemini and ask it to generate a similar picture with the same reference. Don't worry, the prompt will be also in the description. With this reference image, that means with the face, a picture of you probably wearing, for me, I like purple t shirts for my pictures, wearing a brown t shirt, a red t shirt. For the sake of clarity, you might not want to add any write-up on the shirt so it doesn't get it wrong if you don't have the time to regenerate over and over and over and over again. So you say in a studio setting, right, with folded arms, if you want makeup, some makeup, if you want a long wig, add a long wig, anything like that, right? So you do all of this and you ask AI to generate it for you. Then the next thing you're going to do to is maintain the same reference image. And this time around, generate an image where the person is holding a phone in one hand and some dollar notes in the other hand. And once it's done, you just click on the arrow beside the image and you download it straight to your phone gallery. If you're using an iPhone, it will ask you to download to drive first and then you download from your drive or your files. Then the next thing, you cannot ask it maintaining, ensure to add this keyword maintaining the reference image facial features so that it does not give you something that does not look like the reference image so it has to stay on that same chart you can always come back to that chart on germany and continue from where you stop if you have something else you want to create right so this time around you can say oh give me an image of this same image of this same person in the reference image you know looking shocked or looking excited or jumping up or lifting up feet or looking or even crying with tears in the eyes like this one that you're just saying so depending on the kind of content you want to create <clears throat> you can actually say this is what i want give it to me and gemini is going to create this for you and that website that can do this for you very well is nano banana but sometimes nano banana can have you know what we call score score can give you issues it can give you what you do not actually expect so you can do this over and over and over and over again daily every single day to get what you want just ensure that you explain each emotion very well don't say excited how do you say how do you know that somebody's excited the ai may not fully understand how to express that that is your job now to explain okay somebody smiling or her teeth out her hands and fists in the air or her hands on her head or one hand up or pointing to the camera these are different um, images that you can create to tell different parts of the story this also comes very handy for those who are creating faceless ai content especially the storytelling niches right so 
before you go generating or turning your your image to a video you have to first create the emotion or the characters do you understand so this is where it will create the characters for you the good thing is that gemini can also create cartoon images animation images just images strictly not video if you want video you have to use sora or vue 3 or flow ai the number of them if you want me to do a full tutorial on how to turn your image to videos let me know just comment video ai and i will do the next video you're going to see on this channel is going to be about that but this is strictly for consistent images and i've shown you two powerful ways you can use it even for other social media posts like your birthday post your uh just writing content so you write on facebook and instagram and linkedin you want a picture that shows what you're talking about maybe you're talking about learning a tech skills a tech skill rather you can generate an image of yourself sitting in a workspace and pressing a laptop or stuff like that to showcase you learning a tech skill do you get that is exactly how this works so if there's any other image you want to create maybe after you've done just come back to gemini and you see those three ham those three lines at the top left we call it hamburger icon go there you will see all your charts on gemini the same way it is on chat gpt the same way it is here on gemini so you go there go back to this chart and then continue from where you stop just continue by saying you still maintaining this reference image create this create that create this and it will still give you the same consistent image and all of that you can also change the outfit of the person in case you do not want to keep using that same color change it to a different color change it to a dress anything else me i like to use t-shirts you can decide to use a suit depending on how serious your channel is right so this is exactly how it works it's very easy it's straightforward and it is free for now but i want to tell you this do not get too obsessed with free um um apps or free ai tools because very soon you're going to have to pay get used to paying for what you need get used to pay for what you want i see a lot of comments in my videos is it free i hope it's free is it free i hope it's free i don't want to train or i don't want to gather people who are more interested in freebies you cannot grow with just freebies at some point money has to be exchanged right now these ai tools are just testing the waters they will soon attach a price to it so two things you need to do one take advantage of it now that it's free two Get your mind ready to pay. It's not bad if you pay for tools, if they are helping you out. So get your mind ready to pay, right? Don't be too obsessed with free tools. Free tools are always very limited. But for now, this is free. If there's anything else you want me to teach you in the comments, maybe video, just comment video AI. And please, I'll beg you again, subscribe to this channel. But more importantly, share this video, all right? Thank you, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.